Today, Ford Field was a party. Time after time this season, the home opener, then Monday night football, then tonight I keep saying this place keeps on getting louder. A new standard I'm sure will be set in one week. Lions fans will create quite the scene at Ford Field. Today, Tierra Braddock caught up with some of those fans even more excited now with what's ahead. I'm Tierra Braddock in downtown Detroit. It is a great time to be a Lions fan. The team has had a historic season and now they are heading to the playoffs. Oh, let's go! We the Lions! Lions. We the Lions. We Detroit, baby! The Lions will be facing off against the LA Rams for the first round of the playoffs. Stafford's coming here next week and we're winning. The team ended the regular season on Sunday with a win against the Minnesota Vikings. Big dog, big dog today. Yes. 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 We got this. Yes. It's a good day. Super Bowl. The Lions also won 12 games this season. This is the second time in franchise history the Lions have won that many games. The last time was in 1991. For this city, for this to happen is an amazing thing. It was the first time for a lot of these fans and big time for older fans like my mom. It's just the whole, you know, Ooh. dream come true. Yes, it is. Dream come true. Many fans showing love to Lions head coach Dan Campbell. We're not predictable. I love Dan Campbell and his craziness. You know why? Because it changes the, it changes us. This is special. Just like Dan Campbell said, we're going to do something special this year, and yes, I believe that's it. That's right. This is Ooh, Dan Campbell, yes. As fans are hoping for a win against the Rams, they are also hoping for a chance to head to the Super Bowl. But I got my hotel for Vegas for that Super Bowl week because I plan for my team to be there. In Detroit, Tierra Braddock, 7 Action News.